This is the day, this is the day that the Lord has made, that the Lord has made. I will rejoice, I will rejoice and be glad in it, and be glad in it. This is the day that the Lord has made. I will rejoice and be glad in it. This is the day. This is the day that the Lord has made. <clears throat> Father, we just come before your holy throne. We ask that you forgive us of our sins we have committed against you and against your creation. Father, ask for now according to your word in Psalm 34, verse 7, that you can your angels around all of us participating of this broadcast, around our loved ones, family members, ministry partners, in-laws, ex-in-laws, and friends, to protect us and keep us safe from any form of retaliation or attacks of the devil and his demons. And we declare Isaiah 54, 17, no weapon formed against us shall prosper, in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen and welcome everyone to another live edition of our uh, uh, Spiritual Warfare Strategic Prayer Network. Spiritual Warfare Strategic Prayer Network. What is this all about? Well, some of you already know because you are members, okay, of our Spiritual Warfare Prayer Network, right? So basically, what is that that we do with our network? Our network has been around for a while, okay? On YouTube, at least for what? 10 years, at least, right? So uh, we used to host broadcasts based on the network many, many years ago. So I have never stopped working with the network. Why? Because... I have ministry partners, they have family members, so I've been always covering them for since the time I started live streaming on YouTube since 2011, okay? So I said 10 years, no, that's longer than 10 years, that's about 13 years. So basically, what we do as a network, we cover people in prayer. We are supposed to pray for one another, okay? So we cover people in prayer. We cover them. We cover their family members. But listen, I want to say something else to you here, okay? Personal prayer, okay? You are responsible, okay, to pray as well. Listen to this. We, as a network, we cover people. We cover individuals, families, entire households, okay, uh, whatever, Whatever belongs to them is under covering, you know, in, including automobiles, you know, finances, everything, businesses. But, you know, folks, I want to say something to you, okay? Everyone is respons responsible before God to pray for themselves. I call it personal prayers, okay? We, we are all called by God to have a time of personal prayers with him. Amen? So, in other words, God expects you to pray yourself, to pray and talk to him about your needs, about your praise reports, everything. So, I do it daily. I have my time that I set aside for personal prayers. Every one of you should have a time set aside for personal prayers. Personal, personal prayers are so important that Jesus even taught us how to pray, right? Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this, give us this day our daily bread, okay? And forgive our trespasses as we have forgiven those who have trespassed against us, okay? Amen. And let us not fall into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Who is the evil one? Satan. So Jesus taught us how to pray, okay, personal prayers. He even gave us the words to say, okay, amen. We can start by saying what our Father in heaven. Where is God in? God is in heaven, right? Let's quote that again. Our Father in heaven, 
hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. So when you pray this prayer, you are actually talking to God. Okay? Amen. You are carry on a conversation with God. That's why we call it personal prayer. So everybody is called by God to take time every day. Every day. We ought to pray every day. Do you eat every day? Do you drink water every day? Do you sleep every day? Do you talk on the phone every day? Do you watch TV every day? Why can't you pray every day? It should be a, a, a priority. Take time, set time aside to talk to God. Okay? We talk to God also as a network. We put Demas to run as a network. We break witchcraft as a network on behalf of our members. Okay? We do that because we are also called to pray for one another. That's why we do this. Now, but I cannot, okay, pray to God, you know, as he, you know, is standing, you know, before you. No, you stand before God yourself. You set aside time to talk to God and intercede for your family, for yourself, you know, right? That's your obligation. So that prayer that Jesus taught us to pray, it's a good prayer for you to pray daily. Why not? Okay, some people say, well, I can add to that prayer to all. It's up to you. But if you just pray that prayer alone, you are already praying a good and powerful prayer. Let's pray that prayer together again. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. Give us this day our daily provision. Okay. Amen. You can say our daily bread. You can also add our daily provision because besides bread, we also have other priorities, right? Pay bills. So things like that you can add, right? You know, give us this day our daily bread. Okay. And then do what? And forgive us of our trespasses as we have forgiven those who have trespassed against us. Right? Amen. And let us not. Don't say, don't lead, and lead us not into temptation. God does not lead anybody into temptation. And let us not fall into temptation. That is better than, and lead us not into temptation. So, you know, when you say, and lead us not into temptation. So now you are saying that God is leading people into temptation, right? Don't say that. It's in the Bible, but it's on the English translation, and that is wrong. Okay. Say this. And let us, fall, let us not fall into temptation, but deliver us from who? From Satan. Repeat after me. Now I want you to repeat after me this prayer. Because I want you to pray the way I prayed here. Because that is better than some translations in English translations. Okay? The way I'm praying right now is exactly the Portuguese translation. That's why I pray this way. Okay? Repeat after me. Say, Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, okay? And forgive us of our trespasses as we have forgiven those who have trespassed against us. Remember, what we are doing here, asking God to forgive us because we have already forgiven others, right? Mark 11, 25, 26, okay? Repeat after me again. And forgive us our trespasses as we have forgiven those who have trespassed against us. So first we forgive others. We love them. We bless them. We pray for them. Then we ask God to forgive us. Okay. 
If, but if you have not forgiven those people yet, forgive them before you pray this prayer. Forgive them first before you pray this prayer. Repeat after me. For, and, and forgive us our trespasses as we have forgiven those who have trespassed against us. And let us not fall into temptation, but deliver us from Satan and his demons. You can say that. But deliver us from the evil one. Who is the evil one? The evil one is Satan. You can say Satan. You can say the evil one. It's the same guy. Folks, if you pray the Lord's Prayer at least once a day every day, you're going to be doing good. Now here, as a network, we also intercede for our members. It's more power to them. So now you have your personal time with God. And then as a network, we also go after your, your evil spirits that have been attacking you. That's why our spiritual warfare strategic network is in place. Okay. I want to say this here again. I said it yesterday. This broadcast now is for our spiritual warfare strategic network members. It's for their benefits. It's for, their, for the benefits of their family members, their entire household. More power to them. More dynamite to hell on their behalf. Let me repeat that. More power to them. More dynamite to hell. Okay, on their behalf, when we come together and knock devils out, that's what we're going to do next. We are going to knock devils out. We are going to break witchcraft, voodoo, black magic, and the like on behalf of who? On behalf of our spiritual warfare, strategic prayer network members. We are growing. More people joined us yesterday after the broadcast. More people joined us today you know, during the day. Our network is building muscles, spiritual muscles. We are growing, okay? We are heading to become a very powerful network because we are growing in numbers. The more people join us, the more power to all of us. The more people join us, the more power we have to confront and defeat Satan and his demons and his witchcraft and his voodoo and his black magic, hexes, vexes, word cursing, evil eye, envy, jealousy, and the like. Are you listening to the Holy Spirit? You gain power and understanding when you sit before God or you stand before God and you pray your personal prayer. Even if you only pray the Lord's prayer, you're going to be doing good. But you can talk to God. Now that is your personal prayer. When it comes to the network, this is a co corporate prayer. Corporate prayer, right? It's not just one person praying. There are people here praying with me. There are people elsewhere, okay, that are not supposed to join the network, but they know we are here. They pray too. The more we grow, the more power we will have against the kingdom of Satan, who's destroying every day. Satan and his demons are causing too much headache every single day. But when we come together as a uh, spiritual warfare, strategic prayer network, then we have more power to fight Satan and his demons and put them to run and smash witchcraft, voodoo, and the like. Can you say amen? We already have several members over the past, what, 13 years? There, there, there were people that's, that joined us when I first started this 13 years ago, 2011. People, a lot of people joined us back in the days because we used to have a bigger crowd of followers, 
Okay, and these people are still with us. Some already went to heaven, praise God. They are in heaven, you know, what can I do? Someday you're going to go to heaven, and what can I do? While you're still here, we are interceding for you. We are putting your demons to run. Okay, we are doing our very best, but someday God is going to call you up. Amen. Well, I know that some already went up see, those from those that already signed up, you know. But they, they died because God called them up. Okay. There are two ways to die. One is killed by Satan. The other one is promoted by God. Let me repeat that because I want you to memorize this. There are two ways to die. There are two ways to die. One killed by Satan. The next one, the other one, is promoted by God. Which one do you prefer? I'm going to die, but I don't believe I'm going to be killed by Satan. I just don't believe that. That is not going to happen. Okay? I'm going to be promoted by God. That's why I'm going to die, because I'm going to be promoted by God. That should be you too. That's why we fight together. I'm going to encourage you, those of you who are not members of our Spiritual Warfare Strategic Prayer Network, you owe it to yourself, you owe it to your family, you owe it to your finances, you owe it to your home, you owe it to your pets to sign up. Why? Because once you sign up, your whole family, your whole entire household, your business, your pets, they all become included instantly instantly and then when we go after your demons we are also going after your family members demons okay your entire household this is more power to you this is more dynamite to hell on your behalf and you should do you should join us because we are growing and when you join us we become even bigger and larger and the more people join us the more power we will have to fight satan and his demons and to knock them out and to smash witchcraft and destroy curses and witchcraft under our feet. That's why we want you also joining our spiritual warfare prayer covering. I mean prayer network. Also, remember, let me explain this because some of you are here for the first time. And this video is also being recorded. So some people are going to watch this, you know, uh, later on. Let me say this, okay? Let me say this. Our spiritual warfare strategic prayer network, we pray several times a day, throughout the day, every day. I said every day. I've been praying like this every day for the past 13 years. On behalf of, of who? Our members, their family members, their entire household, their businesses, their pets. Their automobiles, their homes. Okay. We, how do you do? Do we do it? We enter the spiritual realm in the background. We are not in front of you. We are not on the phone with you. We simply enter the spiritual realm and we go after your demons on your behalf and we put them to run. They see us and they hear us. We are not on the phone. We are not on, on, on here on YouTube. Okay? But they see us and they hear us. That's why we put them to run and they go. They have to go. Now, now we also have our daily, okay, spiritual warfare, strategic prayer network live broadcast where we put the demons to run right here. And you will benefit from this even if you are not here. But you have to be a member. If you are not a member, this is not for you until you become one. Okay? We live in a day and age right now that destructions are everywhere. Every day bad things happen to good people. Every day. 
You don't want us to be sitting around and waiting for Satan to show up at your face and punch you right in your face and knock you out. Do something about it. If you don't know how to fight Satan, if you don't know how to fight his demons, then join us because we fight Satan and his demons on behalf of people like yourself. This is a calling. I didn't choose to do this. I was called to do it. Since childhood, I was called to do this. Since childhood, I remember being like eight years old, nine years old. Okay, I, I remember God just speaking to me that I was an intercessor. I started out with my family, interceding for, for them. I didn't even know Jesus back in the days. But I was already called since childhood. And when I became a Christian back in 1989, then the calling became so tangible. God immediately set me aside to start putting demons to run on behalf of myself, my family, and on behalf of other people. That's what I do every day. That's what I do every day. That's what I will keep doing until the day I go to heaven. Would you rather fight Satan alone or with some of the guys on YouTube? Okay, that, that don't even know how to do this. They don't, wanna, they don't even want to learn. They don't want to mess with Satan on your behalf. They don't mind doing a little thing on behalf of themselves, but they don't want to deal with this on a daily basis, several times a day on your behalf. Do you think they want to do that? No, they, they don't. I do because it's a calling. That's why I do it every day. We're going to do it right now. We're going to knock devils out right now. Amen. Praise God. Are you ready? Pray after me right now. Oh, okay, wait until the end. If you are not a member, wait until we finish here. Then go to brothercardos.com. The website is also below this video on YouTube. Go there to the, to the website, brothercardos.com. Brothercardos.com. And then read about it. Okay, watch those two short videos there side by side so you know how we do it, so we know why we do it. Okay, then sign up. We made it so easy, painless for you to sign up. You can even sign up for a lifetime. That's how beautiful and easy things are. Join us, okay? Become a part of this network, okay? Let's fight Satan together, not alone, together. All right? Amen. Praise God. That's what I'm talking about, folks. We do this every day, several times a day, behind the scenes in the spiritual realm, and now live once a day at this hour. Let's go ahead and lock out devils right now, but I want you to repeat after me. We pray two prayers here. I mean one prayer, but with, based on two scriptures. Matthew 5, 44, and Mark 11, 25, 26. Okay? Repeat after me. Say, Father in heaven. <coughs> Excuse me. Let me say this before, okay? Matthew 5, 44 says, Love your enemies. Pray for those who persecute you. Bless those who curse you and do good to those who spitefully use you. Okay? Don't send a curse back to the sender. Love your enemies. Love them. Proverbs 26, verse 2. A curse without a cause shall not alight. Okay? Don't worry if people are putting witchcraft on you. Just love them and the witchcraft will, be, will fall flat to the ground. People tell me that they are putting witchcraft on me. I say, who cares? Who cares? I still love you. Okay. I tell them that. When you say that you love your enemies, you are disarming Satan. You are disarming Satan. He cannot use that witchcraft against you. He cannot. Okay, so now Matthew 5, 44 says, Love your enemies, pray for those who persecute you, bless, for, bless those who curse you, and do good to those who spitefully use you. How about Mark 11, 25, 26? When you stand praying, 
If you hold anything against anyone, forgive them so that your Father in heaven may also forgive you. But if you do not forgive them, neither your Father in heaven will forgive you. That's why we forgive first before we ask God to forgive us. Now repeat after me. Say, Father in heaven, I forgive everyone that has ever hurt me one way or another. I forgive them. I love them. I bless them. And I pray for them. Bless them, Father. Now, Father, I ask that you forgive me of all my sins as I have forgiven those who have trespassed against me. Now say amen. Now we are ready to knock devils out from our members. Remember, we are knocking devils out on behalf of our members, whether they are here or not. Okay? We still get to their devils, whatever they are. Okay? Now, if you're not a member, this is not for you until you become a member. Become a member right after this broadcast is over, which is going to be about 10 minutes from now. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ of Nazareth, the Bible says in the book of Luke, chapter 10, verse 19, I have given you authority to trample on snakes and scorpions and to overcome all the power of the enemy and not to harm you. Come out, evil spirits. Come out, evil spirits. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, I command you now to go straight to the abyss. Go now to the pit. Get out of our members. Get out of their family members. Get out of their entire household. Get out of them. Get out of their automobiles and transportations. Lose their money, lose their finances, and go straight to the abyss. Come out now, infirmity spirits. Get out now, sickness and disease. Come out, pain throughout the body. Come out now, anger, rage, bitterness, resentment, unforgiveness. Go now to the pit. Come out, depression. Come out, in Jesus' mighty name. Come out, mental illness. Go now to the pit. Go now to the pit. Go now to the pit. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. I command you now to go straight to the abyss. Go now to the pit. Get out, evil spirits. Get out of everyone who belongs to our spiritual warfare strategic prayer network. Get out of them. Get out of their family members. Get out of their entire household. Get out of their pets. Get out of their automobiles and transportations. Lose their money. Lose their finances. And go straight to the abyss. Come out in Jesus' mighty name. Come out of their homes in Jesus' mighty name. Get out of there. Go to the pit. Go to the pit, drug addiction, alcohol addiction, pornography, sex addiction. Go now to the pit. Insomnia, go now to the pit. Constipation, come out and go to the pit. Get out of the ones who belong to our network. Get out of everyone who has signed up for our spiritual warfare strategic prayer network. Get out of them. Get out of their family members. Get out of the entire household and go straight to the abyss. Go straight to the abyss. Go straight to the abyss in Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. I command you now to go straight to the abyss with spirits. I command you now to go straight to the abyss with spirits. I command you now to go straight to the abyss. Come out, anger, rage, bitterness, criminal demons, get out now. Homicide, suicide, go now to the pit. Ghost hunting shows, go now to the pit. Uh, 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 new age spirituality, occultic demons, go now to the pit. Satanism, go now to the pit. Infirmity spirits, come out. Pain throughout the body, come out. Infirmity demons, come out and go to the pit. Come out and go to the pit. Come out and go to the pit. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. On behalf of our members of our spiritual warfare strategic prayer network and their family members and their entire household, I now break all witchcraft, voodoo, black magic, hexes, vexes, word, curse, and evil. I envy jealousy from them, from myself, from my descendants, from my family members, from our members, from their family members, from our entire household in Jesus' mighty name. I also cast out demons from myself and from my descendants and from my family members and ministry partners. Go now to the pit. Go now to the pit. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. In Jesus' mighty name. I command you now to go straight to the abyss. 
Come out now, devils. Take your nasty, dirty hands off everyone who has signed up for our spiritual warfare strategic prayer network. In Jesus' mighty name. Say amen, everybody. All right. Let me pray the final prayer right now. Then I have a quick announcement and we'll be good to go. Okay. Father, I ask right now that you seal this deliverance and that you fill every empty spot vacated by unclean spirits with the presence of the Holy Spirit in all of us, in, in everyone who has signed up for our spiritual warfare strategic prayer network. In Jesus' mighty name, say amen. The Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord makes his face shine upon you and be gracious to you. The Lord lift up his countenance towards you and give you peace. Okay, now let me say this to you. If you're not a member of our spiritual warfare strategic prayer network, do your family, do yourself and your family a favor. Join us. It's not that hard. It's very simple, very easy. Okay. Join us where? At brothercarlos.com. Brothercarlos.com. The website is also below this video on YouTube. Okay. Go there right now. Don't wait any longer. Sign up so you and your family will start coming under our network prayer covering for you and for your family, folks. Okay? Amen? You have everything everything to gain and nothing to lose. All you have to lose here is demons and curses. Okay? Go there right now. Okay? God bless you now. And if you got here late, this is being recorded to YouTube. Watch it again. Okay? And come back tomorrow for more. You know, at 5 p.m. Pacific time, 8 p.m. Eastern time, okay? Make sure you sign up now for our network, okay? Spiritual Warfare Strategic Prayer Network. God bless you now. Have a good day. Bye now.